Pit of the Chim Chimera. Take one. Holy God. All right. Uh, I freaking I freaking suck at editing videos, so I don't actually know what to put here. So I'm just gonna like talk in some parts, probably, maybe music. I don't know. I haven't decided yet. Uh, I also only plan on doing this voiceover in one take, so uh, that's that's pretty yikes as it is. Uh, but I guess I will start with um, talking about this bit. Did I actually just fail that blight? I did. Yeah. Uh, this build is really good for blight. Like I could just block a whole lane because I'm really fat and I could stand there. But if there's multiple lanes and really fast people, it's pretty depressing. What were you talking about? Oh frick! Yeah. yeah, yeah. Okay. No, no. No. So, so. Uh, this build it is a maximum block build. Uh, I reach about eighty-two percent. Um, and on every block, I cast a level thirty reckoning using my surrender shield. And a six linked repost. So I insta kill most mobs and the uh, bosses die very fast, depending on how much or how fast they hit me. Um yeah, so I mean I I just wanted to I, I'm speeding through the maps uh just to show you that I, I can do every single map completely deathless and clear. Um, and I slow, I slowed the bosses down a little bit, but I don't know, a lot of people might not be too interested in seeing them. Um, I do show all of my deaths because this is not deathless. Uh, it was my first attempt, so it is definitely messy. You're going to see me troll a lot. I mean, the, the Minotaur fight is actually pretty hilarious because I'm so stupid. Um, but this is mostly just to showcase what is possible. Um, and as you see, as I'm running through the maps, of course, while I'm using my Cyclone, getting Fortify, this character is actually, like, unkillable in that form. Um, but, you know, while I'm, yeah, like, Pit of the Chimera, a lot of people, you know, have troubles with this, but he can't hit me. So it's pretty nice. Um, and I do not die against this fight because it's a lot easier, but I do die on every other Guardian, um... Once on Phoenix, once on the 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 the, the other non Minotaur thing person, and like four times to Minotaur, be specifically because I'm stupid. Um, and then is the Shaper fight, which um I show all of my deaths. Anyone who saw me um in a Twitch clip, I had one portal left. Or sorry, it was on my last portal. So if I died, I it was it. It was over. Um, it was really clutch, and so I hope that part is super entertaining to anybody who's watching. Um, to be honest, most of you have probably just skipped because uh, there's going to be in the description like skipping to all of the different parts. But um, anyone who's listening, I will just tell you right now that the Shaper fight was so freaking intense oh my goodness oh my god it's it was like freaking four days ago i'm still like losing my shit um but yeah this is just to showcase that you know doing these tier 16 maps is actually trivial um it they had betrayal on it like blight is also not difficult at all people be getting one shot by the fire dudes i literally just face tank them and laugh um, and there was also a breach, which is showcased in one of them, which was also really, really easy. So this character can definitely do pretty much all content just by <laughs> blocking and, you know, letting them, the monsters decide if they wish to kill themselves or not. That was really weird right there. They were like untargetable, undamageable. Like a really important disclaimer I feel is that I was having some latency issues, which actually made it feel like sometimes my character isn't where he is, um, and I was like either getting hit by things I shouldn't be, or I was dodging things I was trying to get hit by, you know? I'm like jumping, throwing my body in front of a freaking truck, and the truck misses me. It's like pretty unfortunate. Um, but yeah, in any case, uh, you're about to see a pretty unfortunate death here. 
um, which I think was a little BS, but you'll see it anyways. Um, and for now, I'll stop talking, probably just throw in some music in the background. Um, and over all of my deaths, there is my talking, and it is slowed down. So, um, yeah, I'll probably talk more during Shaper. Yeah, I thought I might die once. That's okay. Triggered would someone be if I just left it there and walked away? I don't need an exalted order. <laughs> I'm just kidding. I'm freaking poor. Give me that. Okay, well that one hurts. Pickles. Now someone's in the comments and they're gonna say like, oh man, he said pickles at this time, go check him out. And everyone's gonna think you're crazy because 
everyone else just skipped to the cool parts. Killing the boss, no hitting. Same rules apply. <laughs> <laughs> the next thing is... Maybe I need to switch out auras. We're okay, everything's fine. We're still okay. Still okay. Oh my god, not okay. Where'd he go? Where'd he- Where'd he go? Wait. Wait, what? I actually don't know what I died to. Wait, he's not even here. Alright, so we're doing Shaper without hitting any of the bosses. Not just the main boss, but any of them. Here is where it starts to get difficult because now we're actually fighting the Shaper without hitting him. Don't know if it's possible. No idea. But this is our first attempt. So if it's not possible, we'll find out. Oh, well, that wasn't a good start, to be honest. I was expecting to, you know, block the first hits, but uh, my character was unlucky enough to not block the first hits. Alright, that's also pretty unlucky, I'll be honest. Uh, I swear this is bad luck. I swear this is bad luck. My block chance is out of this world, dude! My block chance is insane! Oh, I can't block that at all. I know that one. That one I can't block for sure. Why am I not block? Is that unblockable? Because I've never, I've never tried this before, so I actually don't know which of his abilities are not blockable. Do I have to block everything, but or I have to dodge everything but his auto attacks? At this point, I got freaking two portals left. And I'm learning. Man, am I learning. I am learning so hard. Um, a bunch of things that, honestly, if I had known ahead of time, 
like maybe that just like the danger spells that I have to avoid. I could have avoided those four freaking deaths. So I mean, uh, anyone else who wants to try accomplishing this, uh, first of all, in this video, it is not even the best version of the build that I have come up with. It, I've actually improved upon it since this video. Um, and then the other thing is, as you can see, I just make a lot of mistakes. So I fully believe that anybody who wants to try out this build can and should give Hitless Shaper a try uh, and see if you can do it deathless because then you'd be breaking my record, which kind of makes me sad. But at the same time, do it. It's going to be cool. Um, in any case, you're going to see a lot of unfortunate happenings. Um, enjoy. Father, it's me. Let me help you. What is he? Frick! I didn't know that was re I thought he went into a different phase. Oh my god, I only have two portals left. Oh my god. Just address the fact that I actually have a math major, and I couldn't count the fact that I only have one portal left. Um... When I go back to base after, you know, spoiler alert, I freaking die again, I will see the depression that is that I only have zero portals left and it's doomed. Or is it? Stay freaking tuned, my dudes. Kramer, I, uh, I was looking for music for this video. And I came across this one called English Country Garden. And I was like, man, this has got to be the most unfitting music for this encounter. So of course I had to put it in for the most important fight of the entire... Oh yeah, just bask in the glory of this freaking tune. Oh. Oh, glorious. Oh, you know what else I forgot? I forgot to make a title start thing or something for the close. Should I do that? I mean, I haven't uploaded the video yet, obviously, because I'm still recording this ridiculous voiceover. Um, it's kind of late, kind of lazy. Ah, you know what? I'll skip the title and I'll just go straight to the end. Huh? Yeah, or not, what? Uh, I'll just make an end credit thing. Maybe a picture. Yeah, I'll do that. Last phase. Holy God, last phase. Can I do this? Okay, he's doing this phase. He's probably going into beam after and I gotta dodge it wherever he comes from. There it is. Stand next to him. Hope he hits me. Not like that. There's two balls chasing right now. There's two balls chasing me. Oh my god.
Oh, I see my mistake. Is that what happened if I let Zayna die? Holy God. I have one portal left. All right, note to self, never let Zayna die. Holy God. Oh shit. Come on, Shaper. Hit me, please. Please, please hit me. This is so possible. It's freaking possible, man. <gasps> A lot harder if that happens. Oh, yeah, we do. Where she's going? He's going straight for Zayna. What is this? Garbage. Alright, well, now at least she's alive for this. Where's he end up after? Right there. It is blockable, which means I just got unlucky. No, no, ah. Just hit me. No, no. Where does he end up? Where does he end up? Oh, it's a portal. Oh, she already got knocked down. This is going from bad to worse. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Fight me, fight me, fight, 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 fight. Wait, he's one HP. He's one HP. I'm- look at what I'm standing on! Freaking fight me, dude! Not like that! Hit me! I got him! Oh! I did it! I killed him without hitting him! I killed Shaper without- and all the Guardians without hitting him. Okay, uh, well, you know the drill. Uh, please follow me on Twitch, twitch.tv slash landapandas. Uh, you can subscribe to this YouTube channel, I guess. I probably will post more things, uh, yeah. Uh, but like the video and uh, share it with your cats.